Another handy feature of using OneNote is the ability to change the background of the pages that you create. Each time you create a new page in OneNote within each of your sections, when you click on Add a Page, what it does is it creates a blank page for you. You can change this background. You could choose a color, but you can also add ruled lines or college ruled lines similar to a spiral bound notebook to make your information look a little bit more organized. And you can also apply different page templates that are built into OneNote. So the simplest one is to add ruled lines to any page in your notebook. And to do that, all you're going to do is get to a page where you want to apply these lines. And it doesn't necessarily have to be a page that you don't have anything on. If you already have text and other information on this page and you want to apply the ruled lines background, you can do so. So you're going to go over. First thing I did, by the way, was go to a section, click Add a Page. I have a brand new page. And then you're going to click on the View menu. And you're going to see right over here, it says Rule Lines. And you click on the drop down, and you have a number of different options. You have Narrow Ruled. If you hover on any of these, they'll tell you what they are. College Ruled, Standard Ruled. You also have Graph Paper down here. So those of you who are math teachers, um, if you need to have put, apply a graph, you can do that as well. So we're just going to apply the Standard Ruled Paper. I'm going to click on it, and you can see now it changes my sheet into line paper so when I add text to this it looks a little bit neater. Something else you can do is apply page templates. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create another page just so you can see the difference between. So I'm going to click add a page and page templates are underneath the insert button. So when you click on insert and you come over here to the right you'll probably see more than one but if you click on page templates and you come down to where it says page template dot dot dot. You probably won't see any of these. It just shows you the ones that were most recently looked at. We click on page templates. And you're going to get a new pane over here that reads templates. And these are ones that are built into OneNote. If you go to templates on office.com, there are other ones that you can download and install into your OneNote. But there are some basics that are already in here. So if we click on an arrow next to any of them, let's say academic, and we click on one of these templates, it's going to change the background to something that looks like lecture notes. So this just makes it easier, a quick way to organize your notes if you plan on using this OneNote page for lecture notes. And this will be helpful if you have your students use this. You can go through some of the other ones that are available to you. There are planners, there are, there are business ones over here, so there's even to-do lists that you can play around with. And all you're going to do is just create a new page for it. And then you will click on the notes and it will apply it and then you can add text and add all the other information attachments just like we were doing in previous videos you can apply any of that stuff to this particular page you don't like this you can always apply a new one or our favorite button at the top you can hit undo and it will disappear so it's a very simple way to apply different types of backgrounds to any page in your OneNote notebook